Wrong button. <laughs> Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome back to Atlas. I'm Flinger Foo, and today, well today we're actually just kind of kicking off right from where we left off. I mean, I was gonna head back and, um, you know, in off time, do stuff like that. But you know what? I figured I just want to make this trip like this because we're, I mean, we have to head by this island right here. And we haven't explored this island at all, so I'm probably going to, uh, Explored a little bit I mean it looks creepy and the winds are with us. I just have to move the sails All Right and then When the winds are with us then the winds are with us so <laughs> And hopefully we can just get back to base like this, I mean, I don't want to ram the island I mean that wouldn't damage the island at all that just damaged me. All right, so North West Yeah, we can pretty much do it. We can go through, uh, well, we can go back through C7, and then probably, uh, through, hold on, let me plot the course. Yeah, up through the corner of C7, and then maybe we could just go through C7 and hit the corner right up there, because up there in, um, B6, that's where the base is, up by where the boat is. So we've got a long trip ahead of us today, and of course, there's already our little greeting party out to meet us. Isn't that sweet? Ah. Those guys right there. I just don't understand. <laughs> Seriously, dudes? No, 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 no. All right, keep your way over there, all right? I'm going to go take a look at this island, okay? I want to see what this island is. All right, just stay away, okay? Nobody likes you. Nobody wants you over here. All right? Yeah, go over there to the Swamp Island. There's spiders over there. You might like them. All right, let's see. Let's get over here to this um, island. Okay, now this is already looking wicked kooky. Look at that. That is so weird. Right, I don't want to hit any. What is going on with this? Let's lower the sails. So weird. Alright, there's that. What is on here? You know what? Actually, I'm going to... I'm going to park the boat. It just makes it easier. To get the, uh... Get the rhino off and on. So yeah, give me a minute. I'm going to back up. You know, do the whole, you know, parkity park thing. And then I want to get up there. Alright, well first off. Have I explored this island? I'm not getting a, uh. A discovery check. Here, Mr. Fish. Huh. This is weird. Whole thing is like super eerie. Oh, and of course there's a rock in my way. Out of the way, rock. Come on, buddy. And you... Why, why is there so many rocks here? Oh, hey! Now we made a discovery. Yay! Alright, can you pop out of my way so I can actually go see where I'm going? Rochina and Chert. Okay, waterfall. Alright, this looks wicked cool. Holy crap. Can we walk across these vines over here? Is 
that a thing we can do? Can we get up here? Oh my gosh, look at this. Who's that over there? Oh, it's a bull! There's a foo. There's a parrot. There's- Hey, there's a Bessie! Oh, holy crap, this is amazing! Oh my gosh! It's like a cliff slash tree root structure up here. Oh my gosh! Are there a koi in this pond? That's the water coming down from up top. No koi, though. Oh, that's unfortunate. This would be a perfect place for them. That would be wicked cool. There's another path right here. See, I like the islands in this map that uh, have all the paths where, I mean, it looks like places are really hard to get to, but all you have to do is find the path. And then you can just go right down onto him, and then there's just really just no problem. Oh, hello, Mr. Spider. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Suck it! What is that? Is that an alpha bowl? It is, 207. Oh, and a scorpion. And another scorpion. Uh, this would be a wicked cool spot to build a base. Sorry, I heard something screech and it made me stop and rethink my life decisions. What is this? Oh, this is that little island little bit. Oh, this is so cool. All right, and this map, this island right here is right here on the map in C8 because I know I'm probably going to get a lot of questions because this is a really, really cool island. All right, so hey, if you guys are looking for an amazing spot, um, yeah, this would be it. Wow. All right, can we just work our way around this way to the boat? That'd be really nice if we could. All right, well, hey, but yeah, I think today what I want to do, I want to get back to base. I want to unload the... Oh, hey, they even have elephants? That's cool. I want to unload the boat. I want to get um, crafting a whole bunch of ingots and stuff so where we can uh, finally outfit Foo's Fury with some cannons. Yeah, because it sorely is lacking them. And, I mean, we can get some ballistas and some cannons and stuff like that. And then, eventually, we can probably take it out and go do a bunch of um, cool stuff with it. I'm hoping. I'm hoping. <laughs> Alright, well, hey, let's get loaded up. Um, yeah, this grid right here, I, I, I have nothing but good things to say about this grid. It is so wicked cool. Alright, I think it's time for us to get our butts home. As the sun sets in the distance, we make our way out from one, probably one of the best islands I think I've seen so far in this game. That is so cool. All right, we just crossed over into B7 on the way home. Dude, this is the trip we're taking. Right up like that. I mean, I, I've never explored B7, so I kind of want to take a look at this. I mean, I know, I want to put a bunch of cannons on the, ah, uh, great. I want to put a bunch of cannons on the boat. But, I also want to explore some of these things on the way back, just to see what all there is. Alright, let's get our butt up to this island. I just want to see what's on it. Flowing 8. Okay. And there's some really big islands around here. You can't see them right now because it's the middle of the night. But... In some really big islands. Limestone, cobalt, radiolite. 
is this? Whoa, 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 whoa! Alright, so that was calcite. That's crystal, right? Let's see. Yeah, that's crystal. Crystal was this close? <laughs> wow, okay, so all I had to do is go one zone over and I could get it. Well, then again, it's also in the other zone, so yeah. That's not too bad at all. All right, and I'm kind of digging this little, like, flat little bit. I mean, it's kind of cool. I mean, it's hard to get your rhino over it. All right, well, hey, let's get headed back. I don't want to explore too much. I just kind of want to unlock some of these things. Let's see. Because we're kind of in a straight shot going back to base, so, yeah. And I also want to get some stuff loaded up onto there. All right, see you guys in a bit. It's these long, quiet sails out here where nothing is going on when you start thinking something bad is about to happen. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it's probably just me, but hey. And there she is, gleaming in the distance, still in the night. There's our lighthouse. <laughs> We've finally, finally, finally made it back. It's been a while. Wow. feel like I've been out here for a week. Um, kind of because I have. But yeah. <laughs> All right. So yeah, we get back, get unloaded. Um, I definitely want to uh, get this thing kitted out. I totally I mean we're going full on custom job here. Yeah, um, I'm not sure what I want to do with the sails, but I mean maybe I'll just keep them canvas um, for now. But still, uh, well you know blank canvas. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. But I want to get. Um, I want to get cannons made, all sorts of stuff. There's Foo's Vengeance. It's been a bit, man. Yeah. All right, finally pulling back up into base. Dude, don't... Seriously? All right. You know it's a bad time when you hop on your rhino... Well, you hop off your horse and you're in your rhino's face. All right, all right. So, yeah, let's start getting these guys... Uh, I've got a whole bunch more down on the boat. It's going to take me a long time uh, to get all this stuff unloaded. I mean, a long time. Because I've got salt. I've got cobalt. I've got, um, let's see, I've got copper. Oh, hold on. Let, I mean, hold on. I already unloaded the salt and stuff. Let's, am I seriously stuck? All right. Let's get back down here and let's see what all stuff we've got. Because we found a lot of stuff in our travels. It's pretty cool. I mean, a lot of stuff. And so this is going to take a long time to get this. And you see, it's all got weight reduction in here. Well, the moment I pull it out of there, it no longer has weight reduction. So it's going to take a long time. Yeah, we've got like three different types of crystal, all sorts of cool stuff. It's wicked amazing. All right, so I'm going to be busy doing this for a bit. See you guys in a bit. Okay, I have to admit, this is much cooler than an arc. They just auto snap. I moved that one. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> They're all just... Oh, wait. I, I, that, I can't access some of them. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Might not be as cool as I thought. Okay, so I can access that one. Okay, yeah, you still have to space them out a little bit. Yeah, they're gonna look a little bit, uh, fugly. But, you know, that's okay. Well, they're a little bit misshapen. But, at least now I can access them. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, yeah, this is the stuff I'm going- This is the places I'm going to be, uh, unloading all my stuff into. So, yeah. Alright, let's get back up top here, and of course, it's super hot. Alright, let's, uh, let's see this. 
throw that in there. And now that we've actually got salt, um, and this right here is actually extra stuff from uh, my crew members. All right, so let's see. Let's grab some salt. Now, salt was the defining characteristic of what we were missing from being able to refine cobalt. Let's see if iodine works. Now, I need wood. All right, let me get some wood. Wood. Uh, I have so much strong wood right now. That's that's pretty much what we're going to be burning. All right, let's see. Get that going in there. Let's see. Yes, we can. Oh, no, that's iron. Hold on. That's cobalt. All right, let's make 100 of those. You know what? Let's go with another 100. Sure. Let's go with even more. So it's one coal, two cobalt, one salt. Sweet, because I've got so much cobalt. All right, let's see. Um, Actually, you know what? Let's grab a little bit. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Whoa. Before we uh, um, smelt some stuff down, let's see. Oh, whoa, I'm dying. Where are you? Am I still dying? Let's grab some milk because what uh, what do we need when it's uh um hot out? We need milk, right? <laughs> milk was a bad choice. All right, let's see. Um, sure, we'll grab some sea grapes. There we go. Are we gonna die? Is this a thing that's going to happen to us? We might just die. Holy crap! Wow. Oh, 61 degrees Celsius. Yeah, we're in an oven. All right. Um, goodbye, cruel world. <laughs> hey, welcome back to your island, Flinger. You're going to die of heat um, stroke. All right. Sweet. See you guys in a minute. Okay, and we're back. And apparently the uh, heat wave has subsided. Oh, I can't believe that. You know what? Those other islands that we just saw earlier... Those are looking pretty good right about now. All right, let's see. Um, cannon. Uh, what does it take? It takes uh, 28 alloy, 14 fibers, 20 hide, and 42 wood. We've got all that. So fibers, hide, and wood. And then we should still have that stuff going. Oh, hold on. I also... Well, here. Let's just throw some cooked flinger on the fire. All right. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, that's going to be nasty. Mmm, cooked flinger. Uh, probably a little stringy, maybe a little chewy. Yeah, you know the deal. All right, so let's see. Um, oh, we need uh, fiber. Sure, fiber. Um, see, we need wood, strong wood. Take two of those, go put those in there. All right, what else do we need for cannon? Need alloy and hide. Okay, we should have plenty of hide. Now, that was one of the things that I didn't grab a bunch of while I was out and about. Well, that's carotenoid. Maybe I should just do a couple trips around and get a whole bunch of hide. Because that was one of the things that wasn't on my priority list because we've got a ton of it here. All right, so there. Let's get the alloy from over here. How much does this stuff weigh? Probably a ton. It's going kind of slow. All right, so yeah, let's see. Let's get some of this stuff done. And then also, I'm probably going to just go do a uh, run around on the island with the bear. Where are you? Trouble, where are you? Where, where'd you go, man? It's been a while since I saw you, dude. How you been, man? Oh, you've got a level. All right, nice. Now, let's see. Let's get some... Uh... You know what? Let's just get some health for you. Oh, do you have? Oh, no, you don't have very much. All right. Let's go get some. Come on, dude. All right, and also, I saw a level 39. Was it Rhino around here somewhere? So I want to keep an eye out for that one because I don't want to be killing a level 30. Oh, these guys are all viable targets. All right, you guys are just all hide. All right, get used to it because that's what's going to happen. Thank you. All right, let's just grab a whole ton of this, and I'll bring you guys back, and then we'll finish making all this stuff. Gotta be careful not to get in the pushback game with uh, rhinos, because they will push you back and kick the crap out of you. All right, so right-click actually gathers a whole ton more leather than anything else. All right, they're good to know. 
All right, and I'll just throw this uh, Rhino Me in there. So where it's just a guessing game. Is it going to be Flinger? Is it going to be Rhino? We'll never know. <laughs> Chances are they taste the same. All right. Uh, let's see. Um, let's see. Put the stuff in here. Oh, wrong button. That one in there. Uh, keep the fur. Let's see. Hide curtain. There we oh, and also... Yeah, there we go. All right. Let's grab this. Throw the hide in there. Uh, let's make sure really quick we don't have an increased uh, cannon, just in case. We do not. All right. Got 55 of these. Oh, why did we have saps in there? Oh, that's right, because for copper you need saps. Well, I've got tons of saps. Uh, let's see. In there. How many of these things do I want to make? Well, I guess apparently four is how many. Four is that magic number. All right. All right, so let's get up here. Now, there, I should have more than enough room for... And I wanted to get at least six on the back end of this thing. How far, cl how close? You get three on each side. Oh, I think we can actually get more. Okay, all right, so hey, let's see. Um, can you... No, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. And there was one down below that just was being super stubborn. I just couldn't get her, no matter what, to get on that cannon right there. And also, of course, I've got this little short one right here that makes it look like I can't. Let's see. Uh, get you... Uh, see? Get up here. Oh, there you are. Okay, let's see. Um... And I have one inside of here. So, okay. So I've got seven people here available. All right, Mary Jr., get out. Wait, how are you on Mary... Body Mary Jr.? Okay, all right. Hey, you know, if that's the name you want to give yourself, that's fine with me. All right, so let's get up here. Use cannon. No, no, no. Not you steering well. Hold on. Come on. There we go. Come on, dude. Get over here. Get over here. Seriously? All right. Now, I know there's a key for this, but... There we go. Bam. Yes! Nailed it! All right, so now we should... That looked like room for three or four, because I would love to have four. Right in the, I mean, I'd love to have seven cannons just right in the back, just ready to unload, you know, a whole heap and pile of nastiness on anything that uh, decides to aggro on us. And I want them in the back because that's generally where things are going to uh, end up. Um, yeah, I want some on the right side so where they can uh, do their thing, so where I can get do a little bit of damage, but... For the most part, I want them in the back. So where we can uh, run away from them and then shoot them in the face. Yes. And then also, what does it take to make ballistas? Can I actually make ballistas? I cannot make ballistas. What does it take? Uh, search skills. Siege studies, right there. Can I make that? 
I have enough. All right, so ballista turret. Oh, that's right. I also can make catapults. <laughs> Let's see. What does it take to make a catapult and a ballista? Let's see. Catapult is, wow, 140 alloy, 340 stone thatch. Hey, that's not too bad. And also, we can fling things with that. We can fling ourselves with that. I wonder if we could stick a chicken in there. <laughs> All right, let's see. Um, let's get this out of here. All right, and for the, the ballista turret, it's 98 alloy, 180 stone, 140 thatch. Now, what does it take for the bolts? Just raw metal, fibers, wood. Okay, well, let's get some of that stuff. All right. Get just a whole bunch loaded up. Get a whole bunch of that. I'm going. And I think we might also need to do a trip over back to the... Uh, The free ports where we can hire a few more people. All right, let's see. We'll go limestone. All right, so uh, let's see. Bolts. Let's get as many go of those going as we can. There are 53. We're totally going to need more than that. Turrets. Uh, all we're waiting on now is the alloy for that. That's not too bad at all. Um, we actually... I want to make a couple of those. Um, we're gonna need to put more thatch in there and more stone. Not more stone. Well, maybe I should go with two and two. Two on each side. That could work. That could work well. Huh. All right, something strange is going on in the land of, uh, yeah. All of my crew on the Foo's Vengeance are strangely missing. I didn't even realize that until I got back and I went over to go grab the cannon shells. There's nobody there. It's like a ghost ship. I don't know why. I don't know how. But I do know I have cannonballs for this ship. Let's see. It's the ammo crate. Uh, there, there, there. All right, so we've got a bunch. Um, we're going to need a lot more than that. All right, uh, let's see. I pilfered the um, Foo's Vengeance here. I, I, I'm going to have to totally go back over and get a bunch more stuff. Oh, hold on. You're going to stay up here. Um, is this going to help you at all? Thank you. Nah, that's probably not going to help you. But I just noticed also that nobody's repairing this. I mean, nobody. Even though it says they're repairing it, they're just not. So, yeah. Oh, press left. Okay, that's the command. Okay. All right, let's see. Um, put you on... Cannons. Come on. Come here. Oh, well, hold on. You gotta follow me. Sorry, I was setting you up for failure. Sorry. Get over here. Over here. Thank you. There you go. Alright, and also I've got these two right here. Come on, dude. All right, get up here. Get up. Seriously? You guys gonna get up there? Apparently not. All right. Oh, okay, there you go. All right, get up here. 
Okay, you're on there. And there you go! Nice! Alright, let's level all these guys up. Oh, you have more uh, stuff. If you have more stuff, we're gonna take more stuff. Let's see. Here, you got pants and you got a hat. What about you? You've got extra sets of pants. Okay. Here, you get pants. Wow, you're the most uh, fully equipped one. Good job, Jun Mary Jr. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Are you actually going to be uh, repairing the boat? Okay, it is going down slowly now that I put the repair. So does he have to have the repair hammer in his inventory? That's weird. All right, let's see. You know, I'm just going to put one inside your guys' inventory too. Just in case so I can just pop you guys off. Where'd the other dude go? Oh, he's hiding around here somewhere. He's playing hard to get or hard to want one of those ones. Alright, so hey, let's get back up top. Let's get the ballistas made. I've just been uh, getting the, uh, the ingots crafted. That's what's holding me up right now is all those silly ingots. Alright, how many do we have? 147. Let's see. Um. Turret. I would need wood. Apparently I used it all up on the, uh, on the ballista bolts. Alright, turret. Two, and what does it take for that? Okay, we're missing alloy and stone for that. All right, well, hey, let's get a couple turrets. There they are. And there's some more of uh, those. All right, let's get these down there and let's get them set up. I'm not sure where I want them. I just know that if we're going to go over and do the... Uh, um, oh, the one dangerous isle. Power stone island. We need these in our life. This is like a required... Come on, get up here. Thank you. All right. So, are we going to have enough room up here? Is that a thing that we could totally do? Oh, it really is. We could put them down here. Now, I don't even think we need this railing if we're going to... I want everything to be on the right side. Hmm. Well, let's... Will that fire? That will not fire. Okay, so we need to get rid of that rail. Right, now, big question is... And you're going to be locked in there. Sorry, Bob Jr. Actually, you know, I think I'm going to put it down here. Hmm. Actually, you know what? I don't think I am. I know, I know.
All right, so I can fire. I have full range of motion to fire. What about on this one? Right here also has full range of motion. All right. I think we're getting ready for uh, going and doing a whole bunch of cool stuff. All right. Uh, but I think that's probably going to do it for the uh, video. So, hey, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know we, uh, we just came back, unloaded a bunch of stuff. A lot of stuff happened <laughs> when I wasn't recording. A whole bunch of unloading stuff. Uh, but, yeah. And then we got uh, these guys all set up. I need to go get some more crew. I need to figure out what happened to the Foo's Fury or the Foo's Vengeance. It's a ghost ship. No idea. No clue. All right. So, hey, uh, make sure you click that like button. If you're new around here, subscribe. And until next time, this is Flinger Foo. And take it easy, everybody.